Hello everyone, this is probably the one store I frequent the least and I am super excited to come in and share with you guys because last time I was here, this store doesn't even feel like a Dollar Tree, it's immaculate. So first things first, I should grab the cart because you just, ah, I'm stuck. You just never know what we're going to find here. And I promise you this store is the cleanest I have ever seen. There's not even a box on the floor. So they have all their Valentine's Day things here at the front. And these cards are really cute. You can even use them for pocket letters. If you're even just starting out and then add embellishments to it, they're just perfect. I bought a sticker sheet like this and I love it. It's so cute. These vases are huge, so if they match your home decor and do you like the style, they are very, very large. You can see kind of like how tall they are, they're very big. So they have all the elf line pretty much here. You'll see the brushes and the blushes and the highlighters and pretty much anything that elf has been released to Dollar Tree I'm seeing here. Oh, and look, they even have a full stack, stock of the full lashes. The faux succulents are back this year and it looks like they have a little bit of variety in color and these spring flowers are absolutely gorgeous and they have new a new line as well of like roses which you'll see up here in this lighter color which are just beautiful they look so real
I'm actually on the hunt for a cute puzzle to do with my daughter, so maybe something with 300 pieces, 500 pieces I think would be a nice challenge for us. So I'm going to look for something that has a cute print. She loves animals, but I thought, yeah. I've never seen this line of the dollar. Oh, Craze Art, yes, no, I have. <laughs> never mind. They just, I haven't seen these boxes specifically. Isn't this like a work of art? Look at it. It's a rainbow. It's just beautifully organized. This Dollar Tree is just amazing. So this is kind of a rare find. Not all of the stores have them, but look how much taller it is than the regular tall vase. So just kind of giving you a comparison there. So they're fully stocked with all of the moss. Another Dollar Tree I just visited has no moss. So just if you need it for spring DIYs, definitely grab a bag during this time. Otherwise it's going to sell fast. This is where I bought the pretty ribbon last time with sticker, like the sticky ribbon. These would be so cute for cake toppers if you make like a Paw Patrol themed cake and you can use those little pieces to decorate your cake. They have lots of toys here for kids. I'm not um, a big purchaser of the toy section, but there's some cute stuff. would be cute gauze fill for Valentine's Day themed decor if you're doing the traditional red. So this line here, Pullen Corp Canada, is the same line that I bought those really great towels and their quality has been so great so I'm assuming these pillowcases are going to be a very good quality as well. I just bought one of these mugs, they're so cute, I love them. They're fully stocked here, they weren't at all the other stores. So now I'm on the hunt for a book. I think somebody recommended Roses, if I'm not mistaken, um, from the Dollar Tree. So if 
there's any other books you recommend that you've enjoyed reading, do let me know down in the comments below. I always appreciate you guys giving me some tips. Oh my goodness, if I needed any more craft supplies, you guys know I love these little containers with the screw top tops because um, I use them in the acrylic or organizers from Michaels for all my little embellishments, but seriously, this store is on fire with their craft goodies. So if you need anything for your craft rooms or your kids to entertain them, honestly, pop into your Dollar Tree. Look, they even have the color sim markers here. I have a ton of Crayola, which I've already spotted a few things kind of hanging around. This is Nickelodeon. Whoops. Shimmer and Shine sticker kits. I saw the Paw Patrol one. Oh, there's another one right underneath it. But yeah, I did see Paw Patrol at the other stores as well. So I think these are cute little kits as well. Fully loaded. And I think Sky, yes, yeah, Sky's in that one as well. stickers to color they're puffy see like here's some Crayola packaging right shimmer and shine they come with stickers coloring pages this looks cute so a little activity book maybe if you're traveling going on an airplane ride these are wonderful packages. I've seen these at the other stores as well. Great coloring pages. If you guys know, I love to color as well. So sometimes just a nice Crayola kit is wonderful. And it comes with markers. So again, another little package if you're traveling with kids and you need something to keep them busy, I do highly recommend visiting your Dollar Tree for some fun little things. Take a look at the wall stickers.
A few more Crayola brand items here. Kits, mess free kits. Again, just I'm absolutely amazed at their variety and selection. I know if I need something for the kids, if we're doing some traveling, especially my daughter, because she loves crafts too or keeping busy with coloring, I know where I'll head to with her to pick some fun things. Like, look at these. Few of you have spoiled me by sending me super glue in the gel form, so my hunt is over and I haven't typically been looking, but I thought, well, since I was at this super dream store, I would take a look and see if they have it, but there's no um, gel glue. But look at these, oh, these aisles just fully stocked with things. Oh, this is new. I haven't seen the large print wall calendar uh, for this year yet. This is the first time I'm spotting them. So you guys spoke very highly of these glitter markers in my last haul. I had purchased this specific color pack and I think I'm going to put one aside for a giveaway because if they work that well then um, I like to pass on the goods. So I have been eyeing these the last few times I've seen them at the stores and I'm wondering what's the quality like on them? Do they blob on the page or are they nice and smooth?
I keep looking for the four packs, but I haven't seen them in months, so that was, I think, a lucky find at one point. These acrylic container organizers are really great for your craft room. If you need ideas, I have shared with you how I organize my craft room. Oh, look at this. Jewel tones, but a color workshop as well. So these are a newer display to me. Take a look in the sponge area and see if there's any bonus packs. Have you guys tried these? I don't really love microfiber, but I think they're they look like great reusable towels or cleaning cloths. Just looking at these little condiment packagings packages just because I know I've purchased not this one here but these ones and they come with 12 the other package there that I was looking at comes with 15 and I do like using them like if there's a little party or a get-together with children and they're having like a can like little candies or from a candy bar I like them to put them in these little condiment uh, containers because I find it limits their intake of candy so then once they've kind of picked and chosen the things that they like uh paper bags these, these are a pack of 40 so once they've chosen what they like they close it up with their little lid and then they have the nibblies throughout the night or day um but yeah so i was just looking at that they're great for things like that I am loving the socks that they have currently started carrying at the stores. I am looking for some more of those Sears uh, stocked socks, but I don't think they have any here. So I kind of got lucky at a couple stores, that's all. And I guess maybe they sold really quick and I didn't make it here in time. I recently noticed that these are at a couple stores. Is this a regular stock now? Because I've never seen them before. Sweet, sassy. Maybe this is something that will be regularly stocked. Have you guys spotted how cute are these onesies? It's too bad that they don't have any local teams, but these were originally $10. So what a great little score if you do have a little fan in your life. But yeah, lots of clothes here. 
Um, it's really nice, really tight, like a lot of things on top of one another, so it's kind of hard to see, but they've blocked out this brand. Which, that's one that makes me suspicious. It's like, well, what's underneath that little block out, right? But some of these are really great quality, so if you have clothing at your store, definitely take a peek through, because I'm sure you'll find some great stuff. Like, this is perfect if you have a Cricut or Silhouette, and you're trying to practice um, making your own shirts. These are the perfect, um, this is the perfect material to start playing around with. A peek here at some of the fairy garden things that they have. I did buy one of these at a different store in the little red truck. So there's some of the fairy garden little houses which are so cute. But anyways, I'm gonna head to the checkout. So I hope you guys enjoyed walking around with me. Until next time everyone. I, um, I hope you enjoyed walking around with me. Until next time, everyone, have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.